Hi everyone, it's Steve with Card Overflow. I uh, just wanted to give a quick deck profile from this past weekend. I got top 8 with uh, Dragon Link at the Remote Duel YCS. Uh, yeah, let's just get right into it. I'm uh, going to tilt down the camera so you get the full Remote Duel experience here. Alright. Uh, yeah, 3 Lebellion. Uh, probably the core of the deck, honestly. You know, I think Brandon Regained and Brandon Beast are the definitive reasons to play it. Uh, three Magnumut, yep, uh, one Sarnir, one Baldrake, and one Druusworm. Um, the one Druusworm, yeah, of course, uh, the Baldrake, its effect didn't really come up this month, uh, this weekend that much. Um, I think that this card's really good, um, I probably still wouldn't cut it, uh, yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about it, uh, generally, but I really like having the option, uh, especially off of seals and stuff. Um, one Sarnir, I know people are like fooling around with this ratio of this one, but I really don't think you need um, more of this. I, I think like uh, you have enough access to it, you know, via Ravine or via uh, Seyfert, um or you know Magnumut even or Lebellion that that you really you really don't need more than one of this card unless you like want more Bestials, um, you know, as a side deck card even. Uh, but yeah, I don't think your engine really demands that you play more than the one. Um, three copies of Seyfert, probably one of the best cards in the deck. Uh, you know, the Levianir, the Black Dragon, the White Dragon, uh, Absa Router. Uh, decide to play three Tracer. Um, this card is like, you really need to play three, I feel. Um, it's, ve it's so incredibly good. Uh, they try to deny the Romulus a lot of the time with their hand trap is like only an Ash or only an Imperm. Um, so when you have this, uh, going, uh, like, and they try to deny that, it's a big punish for when you play the Boot Sector launch and you summon Tracer and it's, you know, the same combo. Um, it's really impactful when you're going second, uh, playing around Runic spells, um, you know, like you can quick effect to dodge almost anything so uh I, I really feel like this is uh this is you need to play three it's really good uh the one caliber and the one recharger uh for the targets off of that i don't think much needs to be said about these at this point uh you know the boot sector uh chaos space yep uh dragon ravine yep uh three quick launch yep and then you know regain and beast in the best cards in the deck uh, you want them going first almost always. If you have to choose, you go regains first, and then you can set up the beast later in order to grab the regain. Uh, yeah, it's incredible. Um, for non-engine, I chose three Book of Moon. Uh, you really want to cover the worst matchups, I feel, with this deck, and so I wanted a non-engine card that was more targeted towards uh, Cash Tira, so I chose Book of Moon, and uh, yeah, it was fantastic. Uh, definitely recommend that one. Uh, I played... One call by, one talent. Uh, the call by, I really, you know, made the decision to main this card, I feel, because I would rather just have it in my main deck than in my side deck. Um, that way I can really choose when it's good and when it's not, if that makes sense. Uh, and, like, <laughs> you know, just increasing the odds of beating a shifter in game one, I feel, like, adds a lot uh, to your percentages, I guess. But, yeah, I don't know. Uh, main the call by. Um, and the one talent. When you draw it, it's crazy. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> uh, three, uh, Imperm, three Ash. Uh, this is like, you know, more dedicated for Cash Tier. More than anything, you need to be able to have a Rise Heart and then Ash, you know, is just so generically good against everything. Uh, yeah. Going on to the extra deck. Played Boral Savage, Erratic Seal, Boral End. Triple Burst, Romulus, uh, go over these in a second, Baron, uh, Chaos Angel, Dissipator, Scarlight, Striker Dragon, uh, Pisty, Axis Code, and Dark, Dark Charmer. Uh, yeah, all of these I feel are very like standard at this point. I think the deviation comes with these two slots with a lot of Dragon Link decks right now. Um, before this tournament, these were going to be IP and Azalea. Um, but, you know, sort of last minute I kind of decided that I would rather commit to the, to being able to always make a bigger board, 
Um, so when you play these, it lets you combo uh, under your seal. Uh, so you always end like this, generally. Um, yep. Uh, I recommend it. I <laughs> uh, really wanted to commit to building a bigger board. Um, in that line, we can go to the side deck. Uh, three Droll, two Bell. I uh, chose Bell over more Bestials because I wanted to be able to out a uh, big Welcome Labyrinth. Oh, cat's trying to join in on the deck profile. Uh, three Book of Eclipse. This is dedicated for Cash Kira. Uh, the Duster, uh, three Cosmics, and uh, three Anti Spells. Um, you know, a lot of people are maining Dark Ruler, a lot of people playing Talents uh, to be able to out the uh, the boards people are making. So, uh, yeah, uh, played Anti Spell. Definitely stole a bunch of games with this one. Um, yeah, I don't know if anything I would tra uh, change, and uh, I'm probably still looking at playing Dragonlink for Nats. Uh, this deck is uh, very powerful. Um, so, yeah, any questions, feel free to leave in the comments. Um, you know, shout out to all my friends who are helping me test. Um, sorry, Ozzy, I can get in the picture with you a little. Um, shout out to all my friends who helped me test. Uh, you know, uh, Brian worked on, me, worked on the deck with me a lot. Um, Turner, uh, shout out to Nick for always beating me at locals. Uh, shout out to my wife, Kel, for always uh, being very supportive during uh, when I'm competing because... Uh, I get nervous and I'm a mess. So, uh, yeah. Uh, looking forward to seeing everyone at Nats. And thank you. Take care.